Site Designer's Inspector pane is very similar to the web inspectors found in browsers such as Chrome and Firefox. Access a DOM tree of all the page elements and view their CSS configurations. The element tree is a list of the current page elements and their nested children. This list overview gives you a visual way to interact with every element. The element may be selected for styling, and if it's hidden, you may bring it into view. To show nested elements within a parent container, click on the left side arrow to expand that element to see the elements that are grouped within it. This is an effective way to review the page element hierarchy. For each deeper level, the elements will be shown indented. You may collapse or expand all nodes that are nested on the element tree. The element tree also makes it extremely easy to rearrange multiple elements. Simply drag and drop elements on the tree to change their order or adjust their nested locations. You may hover over the elements on the element tree and the corresponding element on the canvas will highlight. This works in reverse as well. Hover over any element on the canvas and the item will highlight on the element tree. If you are looking for something specific within your page, at the top of the tree, there is a search box. You may search by class and ID name or the element type. While you are designing, you can see the element tree structure located along the bottom of the canvas. If you double click on the elements, you will go directly to the style section where you may make modifications in that particular element. The element tree also offers several helpful indicators. For example, if there is a container with a CSS grid property applied to it, an icon will be shown on the right of the item. If the element is saved as a symbol, an orange circle indicator will appear. For elements that may be hidden on the canvas, such as a mobile navigation menu or a pop-up, click on the eye toggle icon to show or hide these special elements. This is handy if you need to style an item that may not be clickable on the canvas. Lastly, along the bottom of the inspector pane, you'll find a CSS preview of the currently selected element. This allows you to review the styles applied to that item at all breakpoints. Let the inspector pane insist with your web building today.